obvious that's why Vicky hates you. Your dad helped bump off her parents. Here we go, folks. Why would my father it's the finale. Bale's killed? I never said he killed Very curious to see how Joker comes back into the story. Maybe they're just intro introducing him in season one, bringing him back in season two. Uh, we definitely have some unfinished business with uh, Harvey Dent. Who I don't know if we can call Two Face because he kind of we kind of he kind of avoided that fate in this playthrough. I think one of my most curious changes uh, going into a possible second playthrough of season one. Good evening, everybody. What did you do? That that was me getting rid of Lady Arkham's drugs. Innocent people. I did what I had to do. I had to make the choice about what sacrifices to make. Oh, oh, oh you psycho! Oh, what is up? You, whatever you want to me. This is up, man. Plans are already in motion. It's not often uh, that you finish a Telltale series. It takes a little bit to get through them. Wayne Manor, presumably burned to the ground. <laughs> Kind of, play, kind of taking their time with this uh, scenes from previous episodes. Uh, yeah, if I'm able to stream uh, Thursday night next week, uh, I will do uh, episode one of season two. Picking up right where we left off. So yeah, so he turns to the camera, so I guess that would be the evil face, had that been his fate. Uh, the crowd, the live crowd plays of uh, um, Telltale at Comic Con and at PAX. I've not been to uh, any of them in other places than that, but uh, those are always a lot of fun. Two weeks until season two, part two. Well, how perfect is that? Then we can do part two, uh, episode two, uh, City the week is after. Still reeling from an explosion, Mayor Harvey Dent set off that okay. five days later. an entire city block and killed innocents. When questioned about his extreme measures. Mayor Dent said he'll use any force necessary to take down the children of Arkham. You're done, Gordon. Give up your bad oh, no. to live. Meanwhile, his opponents are routinely silenced. The latest to speak out is Police Commissioner Grogan. He called Dent a murderer and a terrorist and demanded his immediate resignation. In response, Dent's enforcers attempted to arrest Grogan, sparking violence inside the precinct. These are dark days in Gotham. Barto Bud just started his first viewing of Batman the Animated Series. Oh boy. How long Curious to hear your take. Stay in power. How long can we... You can't be in here. Hey, you can't do this. Shut up. Let me go. Hey, hey, stop. Whoa. Time's up. You should have known better, Gordon. Is Batman going to save him? Now we nail your tongue to the precinct door by order of City Hall. Just try me, you punks. Yep, punks. Just in time, Batman. Ugh. Mayor Dent's lost his goddamn mind. His enforcers have overrun the city. Apparently, our new mayor doesn't care much for dissent. He's ordered a purge of every honest cop we have left. Which isn't many. Dent is a maniac. And he needs to be stopped before he tears this city apart. Yeah, don't let me get in your way. Come on. The commissioner's still down there. Oh. All right, action packed. Here we go. Coming out the gate. We're swinging. We're punching. We're loading up our shotgun. Spoiler alert! Everybody that is just randomly tuning into the stream, this is the finale of season one of Batman: The Telltale Series. Follow my lead. Ooh, headshot. Oh, oh! In the lobby. 
Harvey. Oh. The commissioner. And they can't hold out much longer. Gordon, no nonsense. Oh my goodness, here we go, folks. <laughs> I mean, these are story-based games. I, I I think, oof. I think the quick time events are fine. You know, in lieu of you know building a whole combat system and everything, it's like they just tell stories with characters like this, and they gotta fight and stuffs. Like, I'm not gonna say cute quick time events are like the pinnacle of gaming achievement, but they also don't really bother me at the same time. Case in point, the new Spider-Man game, it, you know. Uh, I think it's I think it's okay. I think it's gonna be good. Yeah, if you don't like quick time events, the you should uh, expect them in games that Telltale makes. The icons will change, but the gameplay does not. Oh! We're gonna need a new commissioner. <laughs> that was quicker than I thought it would be. The commissioner, is he? God damn it! No. Not you two. He died a hero, giving his life for Gotham. I'm sorry, Lieutenant. Now this. This is not your fault. Bastard dents. Krogan was a good man. A family man. Lieutenant Gordon! Gordon! Come in! S Sergeant Kelly! Report! It's the mayor! At Wayne Manor. He's got hostages. And he's killing them one by one until Bruce Wayne shows. Oh, man. He says... He says... Cops show up. He'll kill another. Batman shows up. He'll kill them all. Kelly! Get out of there. Sir, it. I'm... I'll let the coin decide. Kelly! Kelly! Damn it! Ooh. Get yourself to a hospital, Lieutenant. I wonder if it's just, like, an automatic succession. Like, is he just automatically commissioner now, or... I guess he's got to be appointed. Wayne Tower, Wayne Auditorium, Wayne Manor. I'm barricaded in the Batcave. I heard nice. gunshots, but then Harvey's men disabled the cameras. I have to face Harvey as Bruce Wayne. Otherwise, he'll just keep killing people. Perhaps going as Bruce could be an advantage. Even without the suit, you're a formidable opponent. I'll draw his focus from the hostages. Their lives are the priority. Just remember. Yeah, this is not redemption time. We gotta we gotta lock Harvey up and if you need me. He's gonna take his medicine. It's time to end this, Harvey. Once and for all. Yeah, Fatui, I, I understand. Spoilers are flying right and left out of Twitch right now. Which is why I don't want to play just a random episode of one of these things. It's like let, let's do the whole thing or or not do it at all. Own up to our decisions. Whoa. I want a safer Gotham. A Gotham where working people can raise their families. Without fear of being robbed or stabbed or, or worse. Hey, me too. Just, I know I can make the city better. If only I... Okay, I'll back you. <laughs> Come on, Bruce. That joke is in poor taste. I'm serious, Harvey. I'll fund your campaign completely. I've lived in Gotham my whole life. And I've never seen an official I can believe in. Tell you. Aww. Thank you, Bruce. I, I, I promise I will not let you down. Mm -mm, never even crossed my mind. The only real question is this election or next. We'll let the coin decide. <laughs> Lucky. But someone has to die. Are you 
volunteering. It's interesting to seeing just Dent be crazy. You know, Funny. he's basically Two Face, but About damn time. he's just not scarred. But you can still see the, the the way they're setting up camera angles and stuff like that to just highlight one face over the other. Snipers, two of them. Get the drones online. Weird that the I'll that the his it. little like military group is so down. down with this. I throw you an Arkham. Burn down your home. Please, Harvey, let these people go. Oh, yeah, I didn't think that was gonna think work, but be that easy. No, Don't but you know. You look, Bruce. Maybe you'll look smarter with a bullet in your face. Listen to yourself. This isn't you. <laughs> Wait. What am I saying? Uh oh. Here we go. I'm trying to fight it, Bruce, but I can't. Bruce, I only ever wanted to help Gotham. And now look at me. I can't stop him. I've known you a long time, Harvey. You are stronger than your demons. Harvey, no! I could always count on your friendship, Bruce. Until what happened with Selina. Oh, yeah, I shouldn't have done that. This city needs to be purged of people like you. All of you! Traitors. Terrorists. Cops who don't take their mayor's orders. Harvey, don't! This is the only way to clean up this cesspool! Ah. Oh. Ah. Oh. No, please. This is what happens to people who cross me, Wayne. You were the fiercest DA the city ever had. Someone who fought for people's dreams. So much for a safer Gotham. You're right. This isn't me. Go! Go! Get away! I wouldn't let them all go, but... That poor guy's just gonna go running all the way down the sidewalk. All the way down towards the street. Alright, fine. Deborah, my not-so-faithful assistant. You've been feeding my enemies info since the start! I swear I did That Catwoman kind of bailed. It's not up to me. Your life. His life. Even my life. You have always known right from wrong. I am begging you. Oh, God. What did I do? What... What did he make me do? Now, Bruce! Stay back! Oh, God, please don't. Harvey, no more. Just getting started. This is the only way to keep people in line. Harvey, no! This is not who you are. You once said you wanted a better Gotham. Is this what you had in mind? Oh, I wanted so much for this city, Bruce, but I failed. We were good friends. Well, that's what I like about Harvey Dent. This was he's my favorite villain. Two face meaning. At the end. <gasps> because it is the one of the villains that really does get to. Uh, Oh no. Before him. Oh no, get up there. Ah, get up there. Bruce, I need I need the result. Oh, he didn't go for the gun, he went for the coin. Interesting. Drop the damn coin! Without the coin, I can't. I I can't. Make your own call. <laughs> Bruce. Please, I don't, I don't know what to... I can't decide. It's too much. It's too much. I can't... <coughs> A safer Gotham, Harvey. Just like you want it. Didn't save that one cop, though. Yikes. It's all over for me. Well, you know. You should have let me pull the trigger. I've seen politicians get through worse. And all of Gotham a favor. I still have hope for you, Harvey. You'll have the best doctors. Yeah. Sure, Bruce. 
I like all of the Harvey will remember that's from this episode where me no saying nice things. So hopefully, oof. season two Harvey, we'll see. Thanks for watching, Sir Crims. Thanks for thanks for Stay. tuning in, everybody. Episode five, season one Thank finale. You so much. You're well, that's true. Hero. And I'm gonna make sure all of Gotham knows it. You should be rotting in Arkham. <laughs> <laughs> Oh, oh, oh. Lady Arkham hasn't forgotten you. Everything you love will burn. Well, I was hoping the episode wasn't over yet. We're only 20 minutes into it. These cops suck at their job. So I'm guessing that manor would have been the finale of last episode, but I would have lost the bad computer. But I'm fine losing Wayne Manor. That was that's fine. Your usual tea and the entire pantry, I'm afraid, didn't survive the fire. This is from my own personal supply. Oh, Thanks, Alfred. We're not the only ones that took a hit while Mayor Dent was in power. Well, at least you've ensured Harvey won't be hurting anyone else. Bruce, these last few weeks, I worry about the toll they've taken on you. Facing off against Harvey and Oswald in a matter of days. D not just the physical toll. Those were men you once trusted, and after finding out what you did about your father, people must seem a great disappointment to you. Always letting you down, even those whom you admire. Not Silver lining, like folks. Father or Oswald, and what Harvey became, it wasn't by choice. And me. Oh uh, yeah, you're all right. Everything that happened, I could have stopped it. Oh, here we go. A little remorse, finally. All those years ago. This, this is my fault. All of it. I told you I wanted to leave your father's employ. But if only I had the guts to do something instead. Your mother, she wanted... What's up, Hellwoven? ...wanted to put an end to his crimes. Oh, did she? If I'd helped her... If I'd stopped Thomas, none of these horrors would have occurred. Lady Arkham, Oswald. I don't blame you for what happened, Alfred. You did the best you could in an impossible situation. I gotta mend this relationship at least, you know? It's like, I gotta, <laughs> can't, now's not the time to make Alfred feel bad. <laughs> Second playthrough though? Oh yeah, I'm letting him have it. But our work isn't done. I am 37, 38. I'm 38 years old. Can you believe it? With both Penguin and Mayor Dent off the board, she's the. I keep thinking I'm 37, but I'm not. We need to figure out. I'll be 39 in January. The only thing we do know is that she moved on from her plan to poison the city. With Penguin gone and my CEO access restored, I can finally log into Wayne Enterprises. Nice. And see exactly Worth it. what Oswald was doing during his time in charge. If I cross-reference that with all the data we have on Vicky Vale. We might be able to figure out the children of Arkham's next move. Curious what, uh... Where's Harvey? Oh, there's Harvey. Finally reached its conclusion. All right, there we go. I can also talk Lieutenant when I put Oswald behind bars, but she's been quiet. Where is she? What's she planning now? All right. Well, 
What building was it that he blew? He just kind of blew up some building that they were at? Did we know what building that was? Vicky Vale, mid thirties, reported for the government. Oh, it was the factory where they were keeping the drug. Okay. In the public record, her true name, Victoria Arkham. To think she was here, in the manor, she gave nothing away of her true nature then. The Gazette's records of the articles written by Vicky Vale. This record isn't complete. You're right. There are notable gaps between entries, but yet. It doesn't seem she ever left the Gazette's employ. So what was she doing in that time? This record wouldn't be easy. And the whole block surrounding it. Brutal. Seeing what Oswald was up to could give us a fresh perspective. The children of Arkham. Their symbol dates back much farther than their terrorist activity. They formed to get justice for those wronged at Arkham Asylum. But the message fell on deaf ears. Until they found a leader Gotham couldn't ignore. The League of Shadows of Journalism! <sighs> Vicky embraced this identity to follow through on her twisted crusade. Her mask inspires fear. Not uh, I like the Batman that. Begins game. I thought I was entertained by it. It was, it was like the, one of the last wonder. like movie licensed Batman games we'll ever get. Um... But I actually reviewed it. You can look up the game trailers review of the Batman Begins game. I written and edited and voiced by myself. Uh, yeah, it's lock. It's Your log in. Administrative access to Wayne Enterprises should have been reinstated by now, along with your title of CEO. Wonderful. Let's see what Oswald was doing while he sat in my chair. We're not bitter or anything. Master Cobblepot. Oh, look, they're all little penguins. Hasn't changed much since you were boys. Can we just? see what he was doing. Penguin was tapping into surveillance systems across Gotham. Any building using Wayne Tech security could be spied on from the CEO's office. How is that any different than the back door into the Wayne network that he uncovered? That's not... It's all porn. Thank you, V8 Dave. 19 months, my goodness. Hold on. The bat scriber signal. I love it. Oswald was, was trying to buy an island. What on earth for? Looks like he was using his new legal control of Carmine Falcone's... Ah, I wonder if that's going to come up in season two. ...ran the place. It's some kind of tourist attraction. It was there is a Batman Begins game. There was almost a Falcone Dark Knight game. Island. They, like, interviewed the cast about it and everything. But it never came out. Hmm. We need to figure out Lady Arkham's next move. Of course. What was cool about the Batman Begins game was it was kind of a precursor to Arkham because you could start to uh, scare people. You could throw things and trigger things around the environment that would freak people out. And that was a first in a Batman game. But it was fairly predictable, whereas when Arkham Asylum came out, you had a lot more freedom in how you could do it. Oswald altered several public records using the Wayne Network. How dare he? Oswald manipulated my records as well. Huh. It would appear your degree was in sociology. And my medical records. There are some well, but colorful. Yeah, Arkham Asylum was pretty fantastic when it first came out. No, so finally. No, oh my goodness. Fix. Like a really good Batman That's game. Better. At long last. Well, no surprise here. Oswald wiped away any trace of his criminal records. His background is completely fabricated. He was enrolled at Cambridge. Ridiculous. <laughs> Calm down, Alfred. I'm sure the board realizes by now that they were fooled. All mention of her birth name, Victoria. Uh, I have seen Vice Principals on HBO. Actually, Amanda just watched the first season, and I saw the first two episodes, I think. Something from Vicky and uh, that was pretty funny. Pretty dark. An extremely dark comedy. But uh, good cast. When it alters data, one the bad computer can decode. What is it Miss Vale wanted to hide? Uh, 
Uh, I am of the opinion that yeah, Arkham City is the best of that series, but uh, I can see, I can see people digging Asylum more. It's a tighter game. Here? Better I lore, I think. Just look at these schematics. But City is oh. building in Gotham with the Wayne Tech security system can be accessed from here and remotely controlled. And the uh, the f uh, oh, final boss of Arkham Asylum wrong. is terrible. And the Thank not terrible, but just weird. So let's check her and the end of Arkham City is a little more, a little more exciting. She was using Oswald's access for. All right. Um, what else we need to do? Wait a minute. Oh wait, oh there's a new thing, wait, hold on. I also enjoyed Arkham Knight. Got any cool games on that rig? Um Now that we know how on the PC I manipulated Vicky's records, the back computer should be able to Oh, uh, we don't keep games on there for very long. There. No more holes. Oh, nice. She was looking into Arkham patients, reviewing records, checking submissions, prior histories. She was trying to figure out who was actually sick and who was committed because of Hill, Falcone, and my father. Vicky was digging deep. Okay. Gotham City records, freedom of information requests, post to conspiracy. Good evening. Orders. All to the, Jim oh. the Jim Arnold XP. The Jim Arnold XP. Experience. I'm assuming. Systems. It's a list of targets. City Hall, Arkham Asylum, GCPD headquarters, Gotham First National. I don't think they'll do a Batman Beyond game next, but uh, that would be super cool. We're on to something. Vicky wants to bypass the security at a Gotham landmark. But without a man inside I mean, he had a lot of pretty advanced tech in the Arkham series. He, I already kind of felt like Batman Beyond. She'll have to get her hands dirty. And when she does, we'll find her. Speaking of... Is it Lady Arkham? No, it's one of Lucius's prototypes. On the move. What? But Lucius locked everything away. Well, he needed a better lock. <laughs> She stole from you? After all that you two... Alfred. Yeah, I know, Bruce, but... Why would she do this? Because she's a thief? Is she that cold-hearted? That selfish? She must have her reasons. I'm sure she does. Computer visual. The prototype she stole. It's an electric. Believe in a Green Lantern game, McGabber. Don't. Oh. Bypass any security oh. system made by Wayne. Get me flustered. I don't know. Oh, I don't know if I can. Too dangerous and Get all psyched up for that. That's so. Oh, I don't know. With Lady that would be super sweet. Get the car ready, Alfred. And Alfred, let Lucius know what's happened. I'm going. To the frame rate's buckling, speed. but we're determined. Expecting you. Thought I'd make it outside the city limits at least. You should know by now not to underestimate me. I thought you might be busy with, I don't know, saving the world. I'm flattered I rank so highly. But I know you're not here for me, are you? I don't blame you for wanting it back. <laughs> I'm surprised you had a toy like this. No doubt Batman would use it for the good of Gotham, but the less noble options are so much more... exciting. Why should I give it back? So much potential. Just imagine what I'd be able to dig my claws into. That device is far too dangerous to be out in the world. If Lady Arkham got a hold of it, that blood 
would be on your hands. Wow, that's pretty dramatic, Bruce. Catch. You might be exaggerating, but I'd rather not take the chance. <laughs> oh, come on. Don't pretend you're not impressed. As long cons go, this one was a beauty. Getting into Wayne Tech's lab took a lot more than cracking a safe. I had to get close to people. Your friend Harvey. Poor guy just wanted to fall in love so bad. After that, it didn't take very long to get my introduction to his BFF. <laughs> the great Bruce Wayne. Imagine What's up, Shadow the Link? Surprise when the rich playboy turned out Shadow to Link. Oh, Shadow Link. Sorry. Scourge of Gotham. So it was all just an act. Everything we've done together. A lie. That's how it started. Oh, come on. And now it's over. I'm getting out of here while the getting's good. Gotham's See you in season two, fire, Selena. And I'm not gonna burn with it. If you were smart, you'd get out of here too. This town hates you. Hates your entire family. Just leave it all behind. Do something more... meaningful with those skills of yours. You don't need the money, but... But think of the fun. Gotham needs me. Gotham needs me is like the most Batman dialogue no option ever. They feel about me. After the way they've treated you, you've got one hell of a thick skin. You're gonna need it. It'll be good to put some distance between us. After all, look at what happened to Harvey. It'd only be a matter of time before I crossed one of your lines. Isn't that right? My copy of the Boy Scout Handbook is out of date. I'm bound to break some rule. Harvey was out of control. And he wanted to destroy Gotham. If you did the same. And yes, I put you behind bars in a heartbeat. Looks like we're back where we started when we first met on that rooftop. Enemies. That's not what I want, Selena. I don't want to be enemies. <sighs> Look, Bruce. I'll admit that what you and I had... It wasn't terrible. But you were just another job. A more... Intriguing job than I was expecting. But still a job. All right. And that job's done. I'm done with you. It's not complicated. I'm not a good person. I'm certainly no hero, and I don't want to be. I'm a thief. That's all I am. We'll find some kind of fun redemption I for you next you season. Don't worry. Start. I never pretended to be anything else. Stop. That's not true. I know there's more to you than that. This is just, this is, like it if that this is Batman. It's, he, it was the way he always spoke to her. Why would you even think that? He always gave her a chance. I've made Certainly the Conroy version. Clear. Why aren't you listening? You fought by my side. And together we saved a lot of lives. We're a good team, Selena. You had to know that wouldn't last. But it was nice. While it did. Hunter Jawa says 0%. He's calling on that one choice. I don't know if we'll get that statistic breakdown at the end for that one specific choice. But you just keep on surprising me. Sure. Just because we actually hooked up in the story. that I'm, I'm very tempted to not... To play through this again and not hook up with her. But because we did, I'll do the kiss. I won't need any help. It's been fun. And it's the finale, you know, come on. <laughs> now, kiss. You stay out of trouble. Let's see ya. If I catch you taking what's not yours again, I'll have to stop you. I look forward to our next dance. <whistles> nice, you got a fun little goodbye to Selena. Uh, hold on, Alfred's on the line. Hey, Alfred, I... Bruce! Lady Arkham! She's here! I, I tried to keep them out, but... Alfred? Alfred! Uh-oh. 
Going back home. Well, I, yeah, I'm not necessarily apologizing, just explaining. Alfred. Show that there's a method to the madness. I'm not just, like, making these decisions willy-nilly. Lucius, it's Bruce. He's not here. Damn it. I'm going to search for clues. Just tell me how I can help. Get over here as fast as you <laughs> can. I'm on my way. We're gonna find him, Bruce. Yeah, going after Alfred. Ooh, that's, that's a low blow. Season one, going after Alfred? Come on. Focus. Figure out what happened here. What happened to you, Al? Okay. Ash everywhere. What did they do to you, Alfred? Furniture scattered outwards from a single point. Something big was thrown against this wall. Or someone. Face was knocked over in the struggle. The fight left nothing untouched. Yeah, I don't really know what to connect, because everything's just kind of, like, disheveled. That blood splatter's not a good sign. Blood pattern looks like it came off a high-velocity hit. So yeah, we got blood there, and we got blood... Maybe that hit there, too. No correlation there. Alright. Said high velocity and... Oh. This pool cue was used as a weapon. Swung so hard it broke in half. Thing to connect that to. Okay. Then... A scuff mark. What could have caused this? So ashes, and then that's like an ash mark, I'm guessing. I don't see a connection here. Okay, great. <laughs> Killing it. Detective skills sharp. Completely destroyed. Alfred must have barricaded himself in here, but they got in anyway. Whoa! How the hell? I mean, Like an explosion, maybe, in the fireplace? Alfred grabbed the fireplace poker to fend off an attacker. But it was knocked away. Okay. I like that he looks at it, though. Oh! No. No blood on the furniture. Hmm. The crack 
is a blunt impact. Pool cue didn't make that. Didn't think so. Hmm. Yeah, Bruce is walk very, walking very stiffly throughout the environment. It's pretty casual. Just like, you know, going down the street. No big deal, looking around. See, so not a ton of options here. There's the broken shelf and the scuff mark. Lady Arkham must have used the concussion blast from her skull oh. to stop Alfred. Okay. Oh, wait, th was this not linked? I don't even try to do that. Alfred used the pool cue as a weapon. Broke it across his attacker's head. When that didn't stop him, he used the jagged end to stab him, spraying the yeah, across Alfred. the table. I know what happened. Nice. The children of Arkham broke in. Uh, I am interested in Blade Runner. I'm getting more interested in Blade Runner as time goes on. He had just enough time to grab a pool cue as a weapon before Lady Arkham blasted the doors open. Because I thought of it as just, you know, sequel to Blade Runner, and now I'm actually kind of thinking, like, there's a lot of exciting things you could do with that sequel, and they're teasing some fun stuff in the ads that I've seen recently, so. Alfred almost escaped, but then Lady Arkham entered the parlor, used her staff's concussion blast, scattering all the furniture in her path, throwing him against the wall by the fireplace. So Alfred grabs the nearest thing to use as a weapon to defend himself, Lady Arkham deflected Alfred's attack, causing the poker to fly across the room and lodge into the wall. More blood on the mantle. He smashed his face into it. Wait. That picture doesn't belong there. Oh. 